We're here with Coach Janelle Creighton after the Wildcats 74-72 win over Iona. Coach, talk us through it. You know, it was a great game today. Iona is a really good team. They're extremely disciplined, very well coached. So for us, this is a really big win. You know, I thought we fought through a little bit of shooting drought in the beginning, but we just kept coming. We just kept coming, you know. They got up on us by at least 10, I think, maybe 11. And we just never put our head down. And that's my team. That's what, that's what I'm looking for, especially these early games. I'm looking for that fight. I'm looking for that drive. I'm looking for that relentless effort, you know. And we got that. And so not that... I'm not happy about the win, I'm very happy about the win, but that piece of it coming along a lot earlier in the season is good. Also just us being able to fight our way out of our slumps, you know, and understand who's on, what they need to do to get through the ball, go through the hoops, those types of things. It's been really good. Yeah, Coach, you touched on it there. You guys started the game down 18-7 to after the first quarter. What's your message in the team huddle there? What do you tell the girls to get them back you know, on track? what we tell them is that we just got to hit shots. We're getting good shots. Make them play defense a little bit longer. We got to hit the boards. We had 50 rebounds, but it didn't start that way. So we had to remind them, hey, let's hit the boards. Let's get ourselves extra shots. Let's see the ball go through the hoop with some easy buckets, you know, because of, of offensive rebounds. And we were able to do that, and that helped turn it around a little bit as well. We also ran the floor. You know, when you're in a shooting slump, you got to get, got to find a way to get some layups see the ball go through, and we were able to do that, so that was great. This was an Iona team coach. You guys played really hard up at their place last yes, year. Yes. How did that factor into the, the prep for this week and the ultimate game plan tonight? Well, I think for us, one thing, it gave us uh, a feeling like we know this is a team that is going to be really hard, but we also know this is a team that if we do what we're supposed to do, and we come out there and fight just as hard, we have an opportunity to win. You know, last year's game was really a turning point for us. We were down by 23. Uh, at halftime, and we came, and we, we did not win the game, but we only lost by three. So for us, it was one of those turnarounds where it was like, look, we are capable, we can do this. And I think for us, you know, it happened maybe again just in a little bit of a different way. And, you know, when we were down, we didn't panic. You know, that's the biggest thing. We didn't panic, we didn't hang our head, we just started chipping away. And it took until the fourth quarter, I think, for us to hit our first lead. Um, but I, I was. I tried to not ever be worried about it, you know, just next play, next play, next play. Coach Chanel McDonald has kind of been forced to that, that five spot, especially with Kayla Clark being out early. She was battling with an oversized center, a lot bigger than her, but we saw her put up big numbers tonight. What did you see from her? Yeah, uh, so much confidence, you know what I mean? Working hard in the paint, um, demanding the ball, and then when she got it, she just knew that there was there's nobody that could stop her inside and out. And that's what you need. I think she did a great job. She played through fatigue, which is something she's been working really hard in the off season, you know, getting in great shape. So she was able to play through fatigue. She hit the board. She had 10 rebounds, 24 points. I, I saw her after the game and I said, that's the way to have a, a debut. You know what I mean? A home court debut. And so we, we you know, she set the bar, uh, but we don't expect any less. And we're honestly not surprised. She's an extremely good player. Um, she's come in and worked really hard every day in practice. And so, you know, she's just reaping the rewards of her hard work. And then especially in a tight game down the stretch, how, how nice is it to have a player like Chanel Wilson who is always that bucket to turn to when you need it? Yeah, I mean, she's our security blanket, right? Um, and she, I, for her today, she didn't start off shooting well, but she didn't get frustrated, you know? And she's just growing so much in that way where she's not frustrated, just keep going. You know, she said, I didn't get frustrated. I decided I would just lock down on defense, do what I'm supposed to do on the other end, and the rest of it will come. And it did. And she's, she's just uh, really a steadying force for us. And she's someone you can get the ball in her hands and really feel comfortable. And so it's a really strong benefit for us, and we love it. Coach, thanks for the time. Congrats on the win. Thank you so much. Go Wildcats.